Hello, welcome back to my channel, Open Heart Healing. My name is Sarah Walsh, and today we have another card reading. Um, this one is very clearly a love story to me. <laughs> so, I mean, I think Spirit's just, you know, giving me some nice little fantasy stories to to keep me entertained or something I don't know but I mean I I mean it could it could be a real story for somebody out there um but I don't know but it's yeah I, I definitely got this this love story so um we have the seven of cups the seven of wands and the moon and so I got the message that um <clears throat> it's all about making a decision making a choice see he's got seven cups to choose from she had seven wands to choose from. And she's already made her decision. See, she's sitting here, and this, this wand here is the clear winner. It's the only one that could reach her where she is. It was the only one that was at her, you know, could reach up to her level. So maybe it wasn't so much a choice that she made, but a choice that was made by the universe as far as, like, this was the only viable option. But regardless, she's sitting... She's sitting pretty here. Um, she's standing in her power, or sitting in her power, whatever, because she's got her, her solar plexus here is, is illuminated and activated, which to me is like the your power center, like your personal power. And so she's sitting strong in her own power. She's confident with the decision that's been made. She's confident that this is the this is the right choice for her. This is like her destiny, right? Like none of like there are these other wands here, maybe these other options, these other choices, but none of them could measure up or were good enough or were just the right choice for her. They're only this one is. And so she's just sitting there and she's like, okay, I made my choice or the choice has been made for me or whatever the case is. So I'm just sitting here now. And now I'm, she's like looking over, well, she's got her eyes closed, but maybe with her third eye, she can see him and she's watching him. And now he has to make his dis dis decision. <laughs> Can't talk for some reason. Because the seven of cups is all about, you know, weighing your options and making a choice. So, and so he's got the seven cups to choose from. She had the seven wands to choose from. Um, <laughs> okay, Spirit just told me. Anyway, I don't <laughs> So I guess that she had like seven men to choose from and he has seven women to, that he could choose from. And I don't think it's like all like at the same time necessarily. You know what I mean? It could be like over the course of time of like she she tried out seven men. <laughs> or like considered seven men and none of them none of them were the right ones. But this one, she finally found one that is the right one. Anyway, so she's waiting now for him to, to choose her, I guess. So she's, he, this... Are you kidding me? This one, so this one is him. She's waiting for him to choose the cup that's her, which is this one here, the one with the water. I don't know why that's the one, but it is. Um, with the water flowing. And he he looks like he's about to choose that one, right? He's, uh, he looks like he might be having a time between these two still. Like, these ones I think already he decided no. He already, like, tried these ones out and was like, definitely no, definitely not. Those definitely are not my cups. So he's like, mm, it could be this one, it might be this one. Uh, he's still trying to decide, but like, I think ultimately he will pick the right one. I mean, it's like it's destiny. He has to pick it. So once he can listen to his intuition enough to be able to see what the right option is, he'll pick this one. And when he picks this one, and it matches up with the one that she's picked, then this gets activated. <laughs> I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means. This gets activated? Like, all that has been hidden below the surface, all that has been um, held out of view, and, like, spirit has been doing things behind the scenes that haven't been seen by anybody. But when, as soon as he makes that choice, boom. She's going to, like, rise up out of the water and, like, I don't know, um, marry them? <laughs> what? Oh, you guys. Sometimes you, this this is like the craziest story I think I've ever gotten in a card reading. 
<laughs> what is happening? She's going to rise up and she's going to, and it's going to be illuminated that like, you two were meant to be together the whole time. And um, everything will make sense and all of the, the pieces will fall into place and the picture, the full big picture will be seen of like, I don't know. Yeah, how this love was meant to be. It was always meant to be this way. Um, so, anyway, um, just trying to see if there's anything else I'm getting. Oh, yes. Just as it was written in the stars. <laughs> I just, oh, I think I've just become too jaded and cynical in my old age. Um, that that these love story like fan you know fairy tale fantasy messages are like I kind of roll my eyes a little bit at them but um but I, I you know it is fun to get a message like this and to think about you know whatever but that yeah that it was written in the stars they were destined to be together um so anyway <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this story today this love story with me and uh, uh hopefully I'll see you next time have a great day Bye.